Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, guys, I am so excited, but we are gonna be unboxing my BoxyCharm PR box and my Boxy Premium PR box. So you guys wanna see what I got in here, what my thoughts are, well then definitely keep on watching. So I just got done filming the ColourPop Bambi collection. So you guys wanna see how I got the eye look, it would definitely be listed down below for you guys to go check out. But I am so excited because we got my BoxyCharm box. Now, I typically don't get sent Boxy Premium and PR. So whenever it does show up, I'm like, it's here, what? Like it always just throws me off whenever they do send me Boxy Premium. So I'm very, very grateful to BoxyCharm for not only gifting me the base box in PR, but for gifting me the Boxy Premium in PR. Thank you guys so, so freaking much. I'm so excited to see what we got in here. I know that this month is Boxy Luxe, so I don't even know what we're getting. Did I even pick? Oh my God, did I even pick? Uh, I don't remember. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. So whenever it comes to my paid for boxes, I generally don't ever pick any items anymore because legit I forget and a lot of times my, I don't even get the emails and if I do it goes to spam and I never see it until it's too late and I'm like damn it. <laughs> so I have no clue what we're going to get in here. All I know is I'm really excited. I love getting boxy charm. I think it's so much fun. So I'm not going to ramble on. We're just going to dive straight into it. So if you guys don't already know, boxy charm is a monthly subscription service where you guys spend $25 to get five to six full size items in here with a retail value of $120 plus the boxy premium is an additional $35 where you get six to eight full size items with retail value, like $200 plus. However, you don't have to have the base box to have the boxy premium. You could just have the boxy premium, but you do need to originally sign up for the base box. Once you get approved for the premium, you can cancel the base box and just pay for that for $35 by itself. So I think it's cool they do allow that option. However, for Boxy Lux, you do have to have the base box to get Boxy Lux. So this box actually is pretty heavy. I'm not gonna lie. I don't know what we're getting, I'm so excited. Okay, so this month is called, ooh, we're called the Lucky Box. And the first thing I see in here is a the Beauty Crop. This is an avocado hydrating eye mask. This, it's an avocado. So this is, um, this retails for $18 and it says these nourishing avocado and green tea infused eye patches will hydrate and deep puff your tired eyes. Avocado moisturizes and targets dry skin. <laughs> if you know, you know. While the green tea energizes and deep puffs your under eyes. Say goodbye to stress, treat and relax your under eyes. You deserve it. <laughs> oh no. Okay guys, so I just did a video, which I'll link down below for you guys, where I did a full face of dewy products. Guys, if you're new here, I'm really, really oily. Your girl is an oily ass bitch. And my face does not handle dewy whatsoever. I literally did a full video where I wore dewy face products for 12 hours to show you guys what happens. And my gosh, did you guys love it? In the comments below, you guys tell me, oh my God, I didn't know that's that bad for you. Oh bitch, <laughs> it's that bad for me. So I'll link down below so you guys can see why I get like <sighs> over dry skin products because they never work for me. But this is eye patches, so I don't see why this wouldn't work for me. This is a hydrating, plumping, and nourishing. I definitely might give this a go because why not? And it's avocado and who doesn't like avocado now we're gonna put on this avocado eye mask you know and we're gonna do the guacamole guacamole wait where are they oh my god they're stuck they're stuck in here oh my god wait wait wait, wait. <laughs> oh yeah you know what this reminds me of um putting on um, silly putty underneath my eye. <laughs> That's what this reminds me of. Guys, you ain't ever seen two pretty best friends. Look at this. It's already sliding down my face. This is the avocado eye mask. Okay, bitch. So the next thing we have a... <laughs> We have a glow recipe. This is the banana souffle. Oh 
Moisturize Cream, a smoothing a soothing lightweight moisturizer that seals in lasting hydration without clogging pores. <laughs> These pores need non-clogging because they're craters. It's non-comogenic and non-acogenic, acogenic? <laughs> Making it especially good for sensitive skin. Blend it with banana, chai seeds, magnesium, turmeric, and caca, sika, sika. Oh, fuck. <laughs> It's your recipe for hydrated, healthy looking skin. Retails for $39. Listen, guys, I'm going to be straight up honest with you. I do not buy Glow Recipe because I know that BoxyCharm will stock you up on Glow Recipe. I have the watermelon line. I have like an avocado one. Like I have some other stuff from Glow Recipe. Literally, I got them all because of BoxyCharm. And I'm like, fuck yes. Thank you so much, Boxy Charm. Okay, so I have to smell this. If it does not smell like bananas, I'm gonna be kind of annoyed because I love the smell of bananas. And if it doesn't smell like it, that's gonna be so disappointing. Please smell like bananas. Oh, banana. Banana. God, she's so tiny. <gasps> Look at all that empty space. What? Wow. Okay. Oh, I can't tell. Oh crap, I can't tell, I can't tell. Oh, this looks like vanilla pudding. Oh, I'm just like fingering that, okay. The scent I feel like is very light. Oh my God, it smells like banana. <laughs> no, 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 don't do that. Don't do that, that does not taste like banana. Does not taste like banana. Oh my God, oh, that was like very like acidic putting it in my mouth. <gasps> That's gross. Oh, oh, it's on my nose. It's on my nose. It's on my lip. It's on my lip. Oh my God. It's on my lip. Oh, oh, oh God. Okay. 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 Don't for the love of God, don't do what I just did. Um, it has the most faintest smell of banana, which I guess is really good for people who are really like sensitive to smells and whatnot. So I, I, I appreciate them not having it being overwhelming, but it would have been so cool if they did because I just love the smell of banana. And this reminds me of pudding and now I really want vanilla pudding actually. Oh my God, I, my tongue's kind of like, like burning a little bit. Oh, don't do what I just did. Okay, well, I'm excited to give this a go. Um, that is so freaking cool. So good, like, Guys, that's so cool. Too bad it didn't like smell fully like banana. That would be awesome. Banana souffle time. Let's try this out. Oh. All right, face is cleansed. And now we're gonna put this moisturizer on. Okay, it straight up does smell like a banana. It's not heavily scented, but it definitely has a banana smell to it. Okay, so next we have a car lip oil. This is a hydrating lip oil. It says, say goodbye to dry and thirsty and hello to juicy hydrated lips. Your lips will love this non-sticky instant burst of hydration that comes in six different hints. Swipe this formula for comfortable juicy lips all day long. Retails for $20. Now I, this is in the shade Rum Punch. I, um, find it kind of hard to justify a price point of a lip oil for $20 when you can go to NYX and buy their lip oil for $2. It's so hard for me to justify the price point. I'm like, I can just go to the drugstore and it works just, just fine. But, um, ooh, she's cute though. Uh, we'll definitely be playing around with this. Hopefully it smells good. Oh my God, it smells like coconut. Mm, doesn't taste like anything. Put a little bit of lip oil right here. Oh my god, though, it smells like a pina colada. Oh my god, it smells like a freaking pina colada. That smells heavenly. That smells really, really nice. So I can't really tell you too much because my lips are already done, but I definitely will be playing around with this um, because it smells like a pina colada and that smells delicious. <laughs> All right, so next we have a Maven Beauty. I have never, ever heard of this brand before. So this is a Maven Rose Water Setting Spray. Set your intentions and your makeup with this aura lifting, antioxidant packed rose water setting spray. Mist all over your finished look for to lock it down and prevent smudging up to 16 hours. Retails for $20 and this is a new launch. Ooh. It says roses are said to carry the highest vibrational frequencies 
of all known natural substances on the planet. Set your intentions and set your makeup with our aura lifting antioxidant rose powder. Oh, well, I'm gonna, let me set my intentions. Hold on. You just like what, like 10 inches? So about right here. So, mmm. That smells really good. I look like I'm just like sweating out of the gym. That smells really nice. The scent is not too fragmented, but it does have a nice little scent to it. It does smell a little bit like roses, but not like that really fake <laughs> Sorry, I just breathed it in. Uh, but not like that fake scent rose. I you know sometimes rose smells can be very, very intense. I hate anything that smells like a rose because it can be too intense. This smells very, very nice and pleasant, very light in smell. It feels very, very nice when it sprays on. It's a very light mister. Whether it lasts for 16 hours, I don't know, but I definitely manifested my dreams when I sprayed this. So that's cool. Okay, so last but not least, we do have a Lime Crime Venus 3 eyeshadow palette. This palette is filled with the rapturous lilac, rose gold, mauve, and earthy brown shade. The ultra butterly formula sweeps on richly pigmented color and does not fade or fall out. The, green, the dreamy lavender and rose gold box is graced with the Venus herself. Retails for $38. What? This is so cool. So the one only time I ever tried Lime Crime is when I was gifted like small, four little pan eyeshadow palettes. I wasn't a fan of it then, but that was years ago. I'm excited to play with it this time because let's see how this looks. Okay. Uh, not the prettiest palette in my mind, but it's still really beautiful nonetheless. Great for the spring season coming up. Very, very gorgeous palette for that. So we're definitely going to have to play around with this. Very beautiful shade. Like the shade Heavenly. I just want to look at it. Ooh. And Beam. Ooh, very, very nice dual chrome shadows. Let's swatch these. Yeah, dual chrome shadows. Very kind of light in the pigment, but... Definitely really playing around with this. I know a lot of people out there really do love lime cream, so this would be really cool to play around with this. So that's awesome. Um, let me go ahead and add up the value of this box. So the total value was 137. So overall, we got two skincare products and three makeup products, and I think this box is actually fantastic. I really do enjoy it. You guys know I love when I get a majority makeup over skincare, but I do think a three two ratio is the perfect balance. Two skincare, three makeups, your girl is happy, so that's really, really cool. I think the item, surprisingly enough, that I'm most excited about is this damn banana souffle item, which I will definitely be wearing for you guys. I want you guys to see what it's gonna look like. Next, we're opening up the Boxy Premium. I'm so excited to see what we have in here. I legit, like I said, have no idea what their spoilers are. I never, ever pay attention to spoilers, because I, I legit like to be surprised. So here we have Boxy Luck. I think that's so cute. All right, so the first item is opened. And this is from Glow Skin Beauty. This is a Beta Clarity BHA Drops. This is, okay. It says these reform drops feature clarifying alpha and beta hydroxy acids to eliminate impurities, rebalance, excess, rebalance excessive oil, and visibly reduce the appearance of fine line and pores. Oh my God, it's like they know it's for me. Well, Radiance promoting retinol smooths and revitalizes perfect for all skin types except extremely sensitive okay so that's something that you guys definitely should take note this retails for 48 dollars now let me tell you guys something tell, tell me how the first time i got like a glow product i was like oh my god <laughs> they're giving us j-lo skincare but it wasn't j-lo because her line hadn't even launched yet and i was like oh okay i'm just stupid <laughs> okay so here we have the product right here i'm definitely gonna be playing around with this because it's supposed to first off retinol is a phenomenal for your skin very very good for your skin it has sally salic acid which is again very good and the fact that it's supposed to reduce the appearance of fine lines and pores you guys already know your girl has large pores and help to rebalance excessive oil <laughs> again oily ass bitch it's like they freaking know so i'm actually excited about this skincare i'm gonna start using that tonight to get this working to try to help out anything i can because i'm on the quest for the holy grail to, to close my pores and to control the oil. Alrighty, next we have a kiss kiss, kiss my, what are you? Rowan Beauty, kiss my liquid lip balm. <laughs> oh my God, that's such a cute play on words, kiss my liquid ass. <laughs> Well, yeah, a non-sticky alternative to classic lip gloss, this liquid lip balm smooths the lips 
as it nourishes, regenerates, and repairs. Formulated with the mango and grapeseed oils to hydrate and protect, it provides the high shine of a gloss while the nourishment of a balm retails for $26. And it's in the shade Charlie. Oh, that's really cute. I love the fact it's Kiss My Liquid Lip Balm. That's cute. That's a really cute play on words. So here we have it right here. Very cute packaging. I love this shade. Oh my God, the shade is awesome. I love the because that has a very, very strong minty smell. Ooh, it's very, very strong, but I'm not the biggest fan of the applicator, but it's still really, ooh, still really, really nice. So let me put on a couple swatches right here so you guys can see that this is definitely gonna be more of a sheer gloss, but I like the fact that it has hydrating properties of a balm, but it's still gonna be a gloss formula. Super nice, we're definitely gonna have to play around with this. It smells freaking incredible. It smells just like you're, Chewing on a freaking peppermint, which I really do like having mint flavor stuff. Mmm, that tastes like peppermint too. If it's supposed to, if it goes on your lips, it's supposed to be safe to consume, right? Like half the time I forget that I'm wearing lip gloss and I end up just like chewing my lips. So I'm assuming it's safe for consumption. So <laughs> who needs a mint when I have a gloss? Alrighty, next we have a beauty diva london this is a diva eye brush set so it says perfect your eye look with this cruelty free brush set set for eyeshadow and liner retails for 40 dollars. this is a boxy exclusive it's kind of expensive for a brush set okay so here are the brushes right here let's see how they feel though oh you could definitely tell these are definitely synthetic brushes very soft though very very lightweight oh this one's a little bit more dense um, these are cute. I mean, I do love the orange texture. Very, very soft, very, very lightweight. They do honestly feel a little cheap. They look a little cheap. So I think for four brushes, it'd be $40. It's kind of expensive, honestly, in my personal opinion. But if it works well, then it works well. But we'll definitely have to play around with these to see because right now they do seem a little, a little overpriced for what, for what they are. But that's just me. All right, next we have a, ooh, this is from Tarte. This is the Big Eagle Mascara. So it says an ultra black vegan mascara that lifts your lashes and delivers a fully loaded flutter for up to 16 hours, retails for $23. Listen, I swear to God, they enhance these people's eyes. There's no way that shit ever looks like that. I've tried. All right, let's see how this looks. Okay, but this hot pink though, oh my God, this hot pink is just, <laughs> it's freaking everything. I love this hot pink color. Not my favorite wand. I like very thin wands, but we'll definitely give this a go. I mean, oh my God, this is the size of my eye. Holy crap. Literally, this covers my eye. <laughs> oh, this will probably be very messy, but we'll definitely play around with it. We'll see if it really does give you the big flare up lashes, but I love trying out different mascaras so much, so I'm very happy that it's in here. All right, next we have an item from Haas Laboratories. This is the Rip Lip Liner. This creamy, high pigmented lip liner pencil balances precision with one stroke, demo matte payoff to slay your lip looks every time. The comfortable, long-wearing formula was made to outline the ease and fill in for all over color. Retails for $16. Wow, that's actually a really affordable lip liner. Very affordable, that's awesome. All right, we got the shade Rule. Ooh, it kind of looks like Morphe's Sweet Tea. Oh, that is such a pretty color. Ooh, these two will complement each other very, very, very well. That is nice. Okay, I'm gonna play around with you. All right, last but not least, we got the Too Faced. This is the Hangover Good To Go Moisturizer FPS 25. Hangover Good To Go protects, giving you hydrated, glowing complexion you'll want while shielding you from harmful UVA and UVB rays with broad spectrum SPF 25 protection. This lightweight, dewy moisturizer is your daily source of antioxidants, vitamin rich moisture, and sun protection retails for $35. No, that means I can't use it. <laughs> oh no. Oh, that's so sad. So sad. I just want to look at it. This is what it looks like. Oh man. I'm probably gonna have to put this into my no waste Wednesday. Anything that's meant for Dewey is just not my best friend. It is just my enemy. 
enemies. So I've always wanted to try out the hangover line. Like I've always wanted to give it a go. I never have. I really wanted to try this, but now that I saw it's a dewy moisturizer, I just feel like I would just use it and it would just not look good on my skin. So I'm probably gonna put this into my no waste Wednesday because I, I just don't want it to go to waste. I could try it, but if I don't like it, it just gets wasted and I hate that. So oh, that's a bummer. I really want to try that. Damn it, damn it, oily skin, damn it. <laughs> All right, so let me go ahead and add the value of this box. So this is the value of my box. So technically I got four makeup items if you count the Too Faced Hangover product as a makeup item. Then I got four, otherwise I got three, one beauty tool, tool or two skincare, depending on how you look at everything. But overall, I still think it's actually a pretty good box. I love the mix and diversity of things. I like getting a mix of, like I said, the skincare and the makeup, mostly makeup, but I think it's cool to have a nice even balance. I'm really excited to try out the Haas Laboratory like lip liner. That is so freaking cool. I wanna try that out. The mascara I really wanna try out. The lip balm, oh my God, I really wanna play that lip balm. And like, who would've thought I'd be so excited to try these drops? Like who would've thought? me would be so excited to try these drops like overall i think this is a great box and i'm very grateful that i got it i'm just so bummed about the two days ah, i just wanted to try it i'm so pissed but yeah i think that this month's selection for boxy premium in the base box is fantastic i'm very happy with what i got and now i'm looking forward to seeing what i got in my paid for boxes because i still have my boxy luxe my boxy premium coming in and I guess my boxy charms mixed in my boxy luck. So I still have my two paid for boxes coming in. So I'll definitely see how those two compare to this collection. This one I got my PR boxes. I'm really looking forward to see what I got in my purchase boxes. I think overall this month is actually pretty fantastic and I'm very happy with it. So boxy charm, thank you so much for gifting these to me. I truly appreciate it and I cannot wait to see what we're getting next. So yeah guys, that is it for today's video guys. If you guys like this video, please make sure you guys give this video a cheeky thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you guys have not already. So I do post three to four, mostly five times a week. Make sure you guys head over to my other channels, R for the Life, where you guys get to see my cool, wonderful adventures, my amazing husband, Corey. And a huge, huge, huge thank you to all these beautiful patron members right here. Thank you guys so much for allowing me to live my dream. I appreciate each and every single one of you. And to my viewers and my subscribers, thank you guys so much for clicking on this video. Whether you guys like this video, you guys thumb down this video, you guys subscribed. If you didn't subscribe, you unsubscribed. Either way, thank you so much for being here. I appreciate each and every single one of you. So with that said, guys, I love you guys and I'll see you guys in my very next video. Bye. This palette is filled with rap rapturous, <laughs> rapturous, rapturous, light lilac, rose gold, mauve, and earthly brown shades. The utter, the, <laughs> Jesus, Allie, can you read it? <laughs> oh, sh let's drop that. I've always wanted to try over the hangover good to go for text giving the dreamy lavender and rose gold block. All right, so the total box value is 196. And technically I got four skincare products if you count this product right here as skin. So technically, so right. <laughs> right. And this is an avocado hydrating eye mask. But if this is what I got my, in my pre, if this is what I got my PR boxes. I'm looking forward to getting what I'm gonna see. All right, next we're gonna be rolling out next. Time for a thumbnail. Thumbnail.